Actually, you're the race ambassador. Tell me about uh, today's race, first of all. Tell me about the mini marathon. Yeah. Well, today, Nick, uh, is our fourth uh, running of the uh, Cook Medical mini marathon. We got involved four years ago, and it's one of the best things we've ever done. Um, essentially, it's put Cook Medical's name on the map, but more importantly, to be involved in such an event where we have 3,000 ladies um, so enthusiastic and so willing to get out, run, jog, walk, both the 10K and the 5K, it's really an event for all abilities. We have wheelchair athletes today, and we have a lady who's just set off on the 10K and on a walker. It's absolutely amazing. Uh, all raising great money for great causes across Limerick. Yeah. Absolutely, you know, there, uh, you see all of the, um, the t-shirts today uh, for all different charities. They're all, I suppose, ambassadors for their own events actually here today. And we're really, really pleased that there's such an occasion that they can actually put themselves out there. Um, we have so, such fun as well. We've had a Spice Girls group, which I'm sure you'll see photos of um, in the next while. Um, but it is about um, you know, mental well-being and health and fitness for the women of Limerick and the surrounding areas. And um, great turnout, despite the weather, 3,000 people here. Nick, when you looked at it yesterday, we thought, oh my God, will anybody turn up? And then this morning, open the curtains and the sun is shining. Absolutely, there's somebody looking down on us today uh, to have such a wonderful uh, day and a wonderful occasion. What have you got going on here? You've got uh, you've got your Saint Maria on your on your label. First of all, it's an event you do every year, though, isn't it? It is indeed, Nick. And this year, I'm supporting my friend and colleague, Councillor Sarah Kiley, who's doing it in aid of the Pregnancy Loss and Comfort Fund. And I'm supporting her and many other women here today in, in terms of that charity. It's a very positive event for them. We can just see how many three thousand people today. Absolutely, and it's great to see so many. And I mean, I know it's started raining here, but it still hasn't deterred people from turning up here this morning. And have you got a, a time in mind that you'd like to get? Well, I, I have. I have a problem with my knee, Nick, so okay. I will actually be walking, but I would walk quite a lot, so, oh, okay. um, you know, cool. looking forward to the event. How much training have you involved walking every day, obviously? Uh... Yeah, no, no, I, I do walk, I walk most Lovely. days, so... Okay, I'll let you go and get walked. Hey! The winner of the Cook Medical Women's Mini Marathon, 10K Distance, is here, well done, give it up, yay! Yeah! Well, uh, Anne, first of all, uh, what do you think of your time there? Are you happy with your time? Uh, yes, I am. I'm always happy. You're always happy. Always quite upbeat, you know. Yeah. And what do you think of the event overall? Did you enjoy Did you enjoy the course? Um, not particularly. Um, I work in UL, so I know around about this area. Um, I like the campus. I enjoy running on the campus. Not so much the road. Yeah. And how proud are you to be the first local finisher? You, you run with the Limerick Club, you know. Um, yeah, that's great. That's yeah. great. I'm, I'm what, delighted for the club. And what Denise likes to run with, anyway? Um, great. Um, very welcoming. Um, it doesn't matter what level you're on at, um, everyone takes part. And you were saying you're kind of used to this weather because originally from you're living in Ballinar now, but you're originally from Glasgow in Scotland. Yes. Yeah. What's it? Is it? How you? What's it like? How's it compared to running in Scotland? Uh, very similar. It rains more in Scotland than it does here. Yeah. First, how are you going to be celebrating tonight? Um, I haven't thought that far. <laughs> Enjoy anyway. Thank you very much.